Good morning, Jaguars, and welcome to another day of school. Today is a special day in the history of our nation. So we wanted to take a few minutes to recognize what we refer to as Patriots Day. We have Miss Goodrich here Good and some of our friends who are going to help explain why this day is so special. This morning for flag ceremony, we're going to start off with the Pledge of Allegiance. If everyone can stand, turn towards the flag, right hand on your heart, okay. Hands on your heart, ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. On September 11, 2001, 19 militants associated with the Islamic extremist group al Qaeda hijacked four airliners and carried out attacks against targets in the United States. Two of the planes were flown into the town towers of the World Trade Center in New York City. A third plane hit the Pentagon just outside well, Washington, D.C., and the fourth plane cra crashed in a field in Pennsylvania after the passengers realized what was happening and stopped the terrorists from flying that plane into another building. Today marks the 19th year anniversary of the 9-11 terrorist attacks on the World Trade Center in New York City. The Pentagon and United Airlines Flight 93, which crashed in Pennsylvania. This is often referred as to 9-11. Over 3,000 people were killed during the attacks in New York City and Washington, D.C., including more than 400 police officers and firefighters who were bravely working to save lives that day. At 7 p.m. that evening, President George W. Bush delivered a televised address for the Oval Office, from the Oval Office, declaring terrorist attacks can shake the foundations of our biggest buildings, but they cannot touch the foundations, foundation of America. These attacks shatter still, but they can't dent the still of America's resolve. As a result, our nation pulled together to provide a helping hand those who had been affected by this tragedy. As a simple of our turn it over tragedy, the America, American flag was raised over each site. In the aftermath of the attacks, President Bush signed a resolution to proclaim September 11th as Patriot Day. The flags of the United States are flown at half mass in remembrance of these events. Additionally, a moment of silence is observed as we remember those who lost their lives that terrible day. Today, we, ob we will observe a moment of silence in honor of those who lost their lives that day. Moment of silence, please.
thank you for joining us here today to remember this important event in our history. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Have a great day.